Okay, welcome to a quick tutorial on how to make your heli body. First thing we'll do is make a new component, label that component, double click, heli body. Next thing we'll do is make a sketch, make it on the front plane by clicking there. I'm going to make a rectangle, I'm going to make the dimensions of this rectangle 70 by 150. Type those in, press enter, press tab to switch between them. Insert canvas and I'm going to go from my computer, find the picture that I emailed you, make sure you save it to your computer. I'm going to click the face that it's asking me to insert it on. Click here. It is upside down, so if I go down the bottom, I can flip it upside down. Make it a little bit bigger if you need to. Press enter when you're done. I'm going to trace over this. I'm just going to use my line tool to trace over the straight areas of this body first, which is simpler. And then once I get to an area that I know is a bit curved, uh, oops, T for trim, made a bit too much. And I'm going to get my spline tool and go around here and start to make the nose of my project. And then hit enter to finish your spline tool and go by normal line and then join these two. This is a bit rough but I'm just showing you how to use these tools. And I'm going to go escape and then get my line, my spline tool and effectively join the dots. Okay, next thing I want to do is before I finish the sketch is actually draw my circle. I'm going to create a two point circle, that way I can go from either side of the circle and make sure it's the same diameter. Okay, once you're done, press finish sketch. I usually like to view it from home so I can see what I'm doing. I'm going to extrude. I'm going to choose everything but the circle. I type in 50 millimeters and I have my body. If you'd like to turn off the canvas, you can just go down here and turn it off. And there you've got your helicopter body done.